There is something that I love to do. I love to tour old homes. One time in Missouri, I had a nighttime tour and dinner of this old mansion. And that was the most fascinating thing because it was before electricity. They had a demonstration of the way that they would light a room. They took one single candle, lit that candle, and it was in the middle of glass, mirrors, and magnifiers. And that one candle lit up that room like thousands of lights. And so much so that you could read, you could see everybody, and it was an amazing thing of what magnification does. In Luke 1, 46 and 47, it says, My soul magnifies the Lord, and my spirit rejoices in God, my Savior. To magnify God through you is a powerful spiritual thing that you can do on a daily basis as you direct your attention to the reality of the truth of God you realize that you never have to walk in darkness sometimes we feel like we're in darkness and maybe at that point we need to turn on the light but more than turn on the light we need to magnify the light of God inside of us so that there is no darkness at all. My friend, God is in charge of your life, leading you in the right ways. The guiding light of truth will reveal the way of love and of joy, peace, and rich abundance. If you Consent to magnifying that light. I pray today that your soul magnifies the guiding light of God's truth. Every time that you praise and give thanks to God for this light, I pray that it builds, that it increases in you. The more that you praise, the more that you give thanks, the greater the illumination will dispel the shadows on your path and make the rough places smooth again. Today, meditate on the guiding light of God's truth and know that this light is shining in you and through you, clarifying every situation and bringing meaning to every experience. When the light seems dim to your consciousness, ask for a magnification of this light, and your soul will magnify the guiding light of truth, and you'll gain a deeper sense of appreciation for all the good of God that surrounds you constantly. Perhaps you can't see it at the moment, and perhaps it needs a bit of magnification. But once it's magnified, it's in you. It's a part of you.